guys, welcome back to an awesome Thursday and this week I will be talking about Mikaru makeup. This is what the tubs look like. They are really cute and they came in this cute little box. They look exactly like macaroons. So yeah, I'm going to review each of them right now. The first one being a uh, lip gloss and uh, this is a delish. And that's what the color looks like. This is a light pink. I have used these a couple of times and I love these colors. I just wish like they were in a stick because I'm more of a stick kind of person than putting my finger uh, into the tab and putting it on mine. Now these also come with brushes which I don't really like. They are terrible brushes. Uh, if Mikaroon is hearing me, you need to change those brushes. They're really, really bad. So yeah, till then I will put my finger in them and put them for my lips, but I don't like it. I wish this came as a stick. I would love it even more if it came as a stick. The next one is also a lip gloss and this is uh, either POS or POS. The cover fell down. Uh, they come in uh, these covers, these plastic covers, which you can throw out later. And this is, like I said, a lip gloss also. And this is the color. It's kind of similar to uh, Delish, but it's more pink and frosted. These are the two colors. That's uh, POS or POS. So yeah, not my kind of color, though I do love these tubs. I love the color of the, this tub as well, but not a fan of POS color on my lips. It doesn't suit me. Um, the next one is a blush, and the name is Crush. And this is in pink. I really like this brush. Can I say brush? Sorry, I meant blush. <laughs> uh, it's a mouthful there. Um, this is a pink. I really, really love this color. It's beautiful on my cheeks. It blends with um, my skin tone. So yeah, really liking crush over there. Uh, the next is also, oh, no, sorry, this is an eyeshadow. And uh, not a fan of this eyeshadow because uh, um, it's heavy on my eyelids. Um, as some of you may know, I have oily eyelids, so it doesn't suit me. The color doesn't suit me as well as the texture of the cream doesn't suit my eyelids. So yeah, that's the color. I will just give it away to someone who really likes this color. So yeah, and this is in D8. That's the number or name of this color. The last one is a lip gloss and this is an angel kiss. Uh, I've tried this color and it doesn't suit me. Some of y'all maybe, but not me. That's what the color looks like. It's kind of a peachy color, but yeah, it doesn't suit my skin tone. Uh, kind of washes my face. Um, doesn't look nice on me, so yeah, not going for that color. We'll be giving away that color as well. And it came in this box. Now the description of these products is on the back of the box. I have four different types of makeup here. That is the eyeshadow, the blush, the lipstick, and the lip gloss. So it is right behind, and that's what the box looks like. Now, I got this as a Valentine's Day gift from my husband in Feb. Uh, I have been using it since then. The weight of these, they're really not very heavy. Um, they're really small. You can just put them in your travel bag or even just throw them in your purse. They're perfect for traveling or even if you're going to go uh, to work with them, they're perfect. Like three lip glosses, one eyeshadow and one blush. You'll also get brushes along with these. I've not used any of these brushes. I don't like using brushes and I'm not a big fan of these brushes as well. I think they're very cheap brushes. I will leave the link below uh, in the description where you can go and buy these online. Keep in mind that they also do worldwide shipping and in case you need them in Dubai, you have to spend around 250 dirhams if you want local shipping and uh, you get pay on delivery which is really nice. I love the textures of the blush and the lip gloss. But I think it's fine. It's in my price range because I think uh, a Rimmel or uh, Max Factor blush would also cost the same. Mikaroon is a local brand and I love supporting local brands. Um, I do see myself buying the blush or the lip gloss in the future. I'm not a big fan of the eyeshadow, maybe the colors or the consistency. Well guys, that's all for 
today. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next Thursday with a new review. And please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Bye!